The Jeep Compass Trailock has been launched in India and it comes priced at 26 lakh 80 thousand rupees. It will be available only in one variant and sits right on top of the Compass range. The Trailhawk sees a host of changes when compared to the Compass SUV. And this includes revised approach and departure angles and improved ground clearance. The Compass Trailhawk is powered by the same 2-litre multi-jet 2 diesel engine which powers the Compass diesel. But this one is BS6 compliant. The motor churns out 168 brake horsepower and 350 newton meters of peak torque and is mated to a 9-speed automatic gearbox. It also gets a 4WD low setting and a rock mode on the select terrain system. We were the first to report to you that India will lead the development of the third generation of the Renault Duster. That car will be ready to roll out only around 2023 and will replace the current car in India and also the second generation that went on sale worldwide in late 2017. Car and Bike can now confirm that India will be the lead market for its development but we can also tell you that the car will only have petrol variants. The new car will have a modern engine lineup with likely smaller turbocharged offerings which will not only meet global emission standards for 2023 but also have a slew of transmission options like CVT and manual. The plan for the Renault Duster to have a petrol only strategy is in line with Renault's decision to go petrol only when the country moves on to BS6 or Bharat State 6 emission norms in April 2020. The plan is to subsequently also have electrified versions of its cars, be it hybrid or fully electric. The BMW Group today announced that it will now achieve the total of 25 electrified models previously announced for 2025 two years earlier in 2023. Thanks to flexible vehicle architecture for fully electric, plug-in hybrid and combustion engine drivetrains, the company is able to respond quickly to changing conditions. More than half of the 25 models will be fully electric. The company presented two of its future models, the Vision M Next, which gives us a glimpse into the future of the brand's M models. And it also previewed the Vision DC Roadster, which shows the future of BMW Motorrad with alternate drive forms. By the end of 2019, the company aims to have more than half a million vehicles with fully electric or plug-in hybrid drivetrains on the roads. Within two years, the company will offer five fully electric series production vehicles alongside the BMW i3. So if you love our videos, you've got to give us more power to bring you even more. And to do that, all you have to do is hit the subscribe button.